I, I really think it depends on guard play. Uh, they have a lot of shooters and a lot of quick people that can get to the, get to the basket. So we just got to defend that. I think we'll win the game. ACC is no easy task. Every team, I mean, whether you're playing, you know, so-called the worst team or the best team, um, they're all going to present their own challenges. And uh, Virginia has a couple of real talented guards. Uh, the one, the one's a freshman, and uh, they got a couple, couple guys shooting over 40 percent from the three-point line. So. Um, it's going to pre present a, a difficult task. Uh, we just got to stick to the game plan and um, follow what the coaches tell us to do, and I think it will come out with a good result. Uh, if, we if we shut off the threes and uh, contain the dribble, then I think we right there will it'll be an easy win for us. But if we don't, I think it's going to be a horrible night. <laughs> it's, it's great to get a win against any ACC team. Um, Virginia, like I said, presents its own challenges. and. Uh, we just got to go in there and uh, stick to the game plan. Hopefully we'll come out um, with a win. Very good. They got two freshmen that'll, that'll probably end up being pro prospects in Sylvan Landisburg and, uh, and the big seven footer Sin. And, uh, uh, you know, they're freshmen. They're a little bit like us. Uh, they're young. They're, they're, they're just missing a, a senior Tony Douglas type player uh, from them being probably in the same position we're in right now. They've lost some close games. Uh, they're a team that's very good in transition. Uh, they got some guards that are very good off the dribble, in particular Landisburg, the freshman from New York. Um, he presents a, a big challenge for our perimeter players. He's a big guard. Uh, so uh, uh, Chris Singleton, Jordan DeMercy, you know, Darwin Kitchen, those guys have to, uh, to handle the, uh, the, the responsibilities of not letting him have a big night. These guys have really got to lock in as a young team and, and, and not play like a young team now. We've got 19, this will be our 20th game. We've got 19 games behind us. They've got experience now. They've got minutes. They've been in situations. We've been in a lot of close games. Uh, that has to be something that becomes a very positive and a, and a strength for us on how to continue to win those close games because, as you well know and our fans know, in the ACC, most games are going to come down to the last three or four minutes, and we need to, uh, we, we need to lock up and, and make those key plays that allow us to win. There are so many similarities, more similarities than there are differences. Every team's well coached, every team's loaded with talent. They execute very well. They all have great home court advantages. When you go on the road, you just got to be at your very, very best. Uh, I know you sound like a, you sound like a broken record, but that's the way the league is shaping up. Uh, Virginia, I believe, I think they've won one game. They beat a win, one in overtime at uh, at Georgia Tech, uh, but they very well could have beaten uh, Maryland and Virginia Tech. Uh, they did not have a chance against North Carolina, but they very well could be three and one as opposed to one and three. Uh, that's the way the league is. They're a very good basketball team. We got to be at our very best to go on the road and come away with a victory.